Hi guys, in this video, we will instruct you step by step how to start using AutoFace. From setups to optimizing key functions, the goal is to help you quickly get acquainted and take advantage of the full potential of the software on Facebook. After successfully downloading the AutoFace app, open the app and then log into your AutoFace account. If you have not registered for an AutoFace account before, press the register button to register your AutoFace account. Please fill in the information completely and accurately on the AutoFace account registration screen. Email, enter the email you want to use to register for an AutoFace account. Password, enter the password for your AutoFace account. Confirm password, fill in the correct password you entered above. Contact, enter your phone number. After you click agree to the terms of service, privacy policy and refund policy, click register to complete your registration process. After successfully registering an account, you will return to the original login screen. Here, you just need to log into your AutoFace account using the email and password registered above. You can press remember me to remember your login account for next time or press forgot password when you forget your login password. After successfully logging in, the screen will display the interface as below. Click the plus icon to add your Facebook account to your AutoFace account. Facebook account needs to be entered in the following format, UID, password, 2FA, recovery email, recovery emails password, cookie, date of birth. UID and password fields are required. If the remaining fields are not available, you can leave them blank. We support the following login methods, login using UID and password or login using cookies. Each account will be entered on one line. After entering information for one account, press enter to proceed to enter the next accounts. You can add tag or add proxy to your profile. AutoFace currently supports importing proxy types, HTTP, SOC S4 and SOC S5. You enter the proxy in the format host, host, username, password. Proxies will be taken from top to bottom to enter the profiles above. After entering the information, click add to add profile. Once added, profiles will be displayed in the overview section of the app. I will introduce to you the functions on this overview page. Search bar, quickly search profiles according to the keyword you enter. You can easily search your profiles by UID, name, email, proxy, tag. Refresh, refresh the page. Display settings, here you can set your profile to display the information you want to display and click save to save. Automation setting. Setting up how to run automation. You can set the number of profiles to run at the same time, number of loops, run type, random or from top to bottom. Advanced settings, set maximum time per thread, delay when new thread is run, stop running if RAM, CPU disk exceed a certain percent. Proxy settings, you can add proxies in the format host, port, username, password with proxy types such as, HTTP, SOC S4, SOC S5, SSH. When you have finished entering the proxy information, press add to add the proxy. After entering the proxy, it will appear in the proxy list section on the left hand side of the screen. Assign proxy here to all selected profiles. When you enable this option, the proxies you added in the automation settings section will be given priority for the profiles you have selected to run the automation script. When you turn off this option, the system will retrieve the proxy information you installed in the original profile. Script Manager. In this section, you can create scripts, view system scripts, and manage your created scripts. Next, I will show you how to create and manage automation scripts. In the Script Manager section, Select Create New Script to create an automation script. AutoFace allows you to create automation scripts according to your wishes with just simple drag and drop commands. In the Automation Script Creation section, AutoFace scripts are divided into three main groups. General Interaction. In this section, you can create automation scripts such as viewing news, watching videos, surfing news feed, creating and posting posts. Group Interaction. In the Group section, you can post in the group, join any group, invite friends to the group, leave the group. Seating. Seating scripts include increasing likes and comments, boost followers for selected accounts and boost views for videos. Here, I try to create a simple newsfeed surfing script. You proceed to pull out the newsfeed script, edit the information as desired such as viewing time, delay, other actions depending on the script and connect a starting point to create a complete script. Then you name your script, enter note if you want and press save to save the script. Scripts, once created, will appear in the your scripts section. 
You can manage your scripts by fields such as name, status, tag, notes, and creation date. You can also edit, delete, duplicate or pin the script to the top to facilitate searching. Next I will show you how to run the automation script. To get started, you need to create a login script to log into your account for the first time. Currently AutoFace supports two types of login, login with cookies or login with UID. You choose the appropriate login form for your accounts. Here, because my account does not include cookies, I choose to log in with UID and password. Then adjust the delay time. Next, name your script, enter notes if desired. Before saving the script, press debug to check for errors if any in the script and select the run test button to check if there are any errors or not. After completing the setup, click save to save the script. You start by selecting the profiles you want to run automation on. Before running, you can add a proxy to your profile. Press the remove button when you want to delete the selected profiles. When pressing run, the system will display a pop-up to select the run script for the selected profile. You choose the login script for the first time login. The system will log in your Facebook accounts automatically. Above, AutoFace has shown you how to use Facebook automation software, AutoFace. Thank you for trusting and supporting us. If you have any questions about the software, don't hesitate to contact our support team via Facebook, Telegram, Twitter, and Skype. See you again in the next videos.